Open Bridge Designer Connect Edition version 1009 with RM Bridge in bending, cracking and longitudinal reinforcements. Bending reinforcement is used with the schedule actions wood soup for envelopes and wood LC for load cases. When performing the ultimate load capacity check uh, for the chosen uh, standard code. For ultimate load capacity check, the relevant internal force state must be available, the required material properties must be defined in the materials table, the respective reinforcement groups must be specified, and the reinforcement amount can be prescribed by the user or calculated by the program. The cracking reinforcement is used with the schedule actions crack soup and crack LC. This schedule action calculates the required additional reinforcement to meet the crack width design criteria. The crack width design usually defined in the individual national codes includes the verification of a minimum reinforcement area and the limitation of the crack width for the structural elements under the relevant load combination. The reinforcement is calculated, presuming the cracked conditions and the non-linear material behavior. Longitudinal reinforcement can be used in all previous schedule actions. Ult soup, ult LC, crack soup and crack LC. It considers the maximum area values obtained in bending and cracking calculation, and after it can be used to compute the reinforcement layouts for drawings production. The bars arrangement, two solutions are available. Bars uniformly uh, arranged along a specified line that can be straight, polygonal or curved, and bars arranged in specified points. The reinforcement layout can be presented in the main window and the output results saved in an Excel spreadsheet file or LST file. The longitudinal reinforcement can uh, be also used to produce the 3D DGN file for continuing the bridge project development. So let's see how it works. We start by opening the Open Bridge Designer and create a new file. Choose the standalone workflow for going directly to the analytical programs and open RM Bridge. We can now open our RM Bridge model. And here we are using our training example for segmental bridges. Go to Modeler for starting the reinforcement attributes and reference set definition. First, we are going to define the bending and the cracking reinforcement types.
we can recalculate modeler and send the information to analyzer for calculation. In schedule actions, we have inserting the crack sub action for the cracking verification and reinforcement calculation and the old sub action for performing the ultimate capacity check and calculate the bending reinforcement area value. After running, we can see the following diagrams. The cracking and the bending reinforcement area values calculated by the program. And the third diagram that uh, represents the design resistance and the, the ultimate envelope for the longitudinal bending moment. Now we are going to use the longitudinal reinforcement type. The process is exactly the same uh, that we have done before. After running, we can clearly see that the program considers for the final reinforcement area value the maximum amount of reinforcement obtained in the cracking and in the ultimate check capacity calculations. For rebars arrangement or reinforcement layout, we have introduced in the latest versions uh, some new features that will allow the user to have one fil final distribution of the reinforcement in the cross-section. The new reinforcement layout stands for the longitudinal and shear for webs reinforcement types. 
User needs to define the reinforcement library, the preferred bar size, the range of bars for calculation, the concrete cover, the minimum and maximum spacing between bars, the number of layouts of different reinforcement solutions for being calculated. The reinforcement layout is calculated by optimizing the weight of steel spent in the bridge project. User can see the bar's arrangement uh, in the main view and can have access to the output file where are presented the area value uh, provided, the final area value provided, very close to the calculated and the layout solution for the provided value. User can either generate the 3D DGN file with the presented information and after can continue the, the project work inside of OpenBridge Modeler for the drawings production. This was OBD Connect Edition version 10.09 with RM Bridge in bending, cracking and longitudinal reinforcements.